In life with diabetes, food is such a stressful, frustrating thing. Because in so many moments of our life, food is our hero. Food saves our life when we are having a low blood sugar. But in so many other moments, food can hurt us. It can make our blood sugars too high. It can make us have to count carbohydrates that are impossible to count. This thing that you're not supposed to eat too much of. You shouldn't eat this and you shouldn't eat that. You've got to eat more of this, but you shouldn't eat any of that. That food over there is bad. It's constant. It's everywhere you go. You have to think about the food that you're eating, the food that you're looking at, the food that you're thinking about possibly eating, and then how to fit that into your life with diabetes. It gives food so much power over us. The first step in building a healthier relationship with food isn't to say, I'm not going to eat any more of whatever food I usually eat too much of. The first step is actually to look at exactly where you are right now in your relationship with food and diabetes. Look at exactly what is going on. A balanced relationship with food is actually about feeling proud of all of your choices while never feeling deprived, which means there's still room for potato chips or chocolate or ice cream. And in the end, you know, and you feel confident in the fact that you are giving yourself, your body, and your life with diabetes the compassion that you need and deserve.